another local made a cut is like this. These strange looking planes have been made from scratch using scrap metals and a lot of sweat and improvisation. Some of these the away planes fly and many don't. Nonetheless, these are the creations of amateur engineers from Africa. The first guy is so confident that he'll fly, that he doesn't need a seatbelt. This is absolutely genius. It uses a diesel engine like a tractor. The propeller seems good for cutting leaves and stems. You might as well call it a stem cutter. Salute to the pilot's bravery, because even though he was more confident in his work than his designer, he had to lower his pride and call for help. The material used came from a local market, because can you imagine making a helicopter using a sewing machine? Rumors have it that he has just passed Brazil and that the Air Force has just stopped him. Even though it doesn't fly, at least he has fulfilled his dreams. The front wheel got lost while he was landing, so he can't fly for now. He says that he's planning on improving the landing gear. And this is because I wanted to do a piloting, but because my parents were not able to cater for my needs as to piloting needs. So I had to make mine so that I can fly on it. I achieve my dream. Even so, he still has good innovation skills and it's not bad for children's entertainment. The tires need to be adjusted manually, just like the bicycle wheels. I'm sure if he tries to jump start it from a cliff, it will definitely fly. Even though it can't fly, it can work, not forgetting that it takes a lot of sweat, tears, and work just to build one. Assume my dream. Meanwhile, somewhere in Africa. Okay, after years of planning and watching horror movies, he decided to build one of his own. Actually, it has been a long time ago, since 1994. It is now 18 years. We've made a number of trials, from a childish, uh, childish trials to what we call now a mature, a mature trial. I guess the reason that this plane isn't flying is because how can a one-ton plane be lifted by a 10-horsepower engine? He sold his first plane to the Ugandan Airlines. It's conducting a patrol, so you don't need proof if this one flies. Let's give him a moment to admire his creation. This craft has a, a battery, eh? then it has a, a tank, uh, then the seat eh? for the pilot. I'm going to show you how I'm ready to fly. Yeah. I first of all put on the ignition switch which we have seen. And it has pedals, auxiliary control pedals, which helps to control the heading of the helicopter in a coordinated direction of flight. The guys are preparing for World War I at this point. And though it doesn't fly, it's pretty clear that he's on the right path. But as they say, happiness is simple. It doesn't need to be expensive. Take a propeller. Our next pilot couldn't build a real plane, so he built this. It was a big achievement because even the governor was present that day. Excuse, excuse him. Uh, 
pilot. Air pilot is watching from Emirates. Sadly, it wouldn't fly because it only flies when the sun is around. Now, we have a similar chopper, but this time it actually lifts off. Another, another local made helicopter. It's like this one we fly. It's like this one we fly. Yeah, whoa, whoa. It's like this one we fly. Yeah, this one we fly. This one is flying. I'm going to tomorrow. Tomorrow I will start building my own. Wow. Wonderful. Wonderful. Jesus. Hey. How is he going to land? Hey, whoa. This plane will definitely go places. But not upwards. The paint obviously cost more than the chopper itself. It flies too. But after the video though. However, he definitely knows his way around a cockpit. So that's that. Mbanga has taken matters into his own hands. Dubbed by his friends as the helicopter man, Hendrik built this model from scrap material in his backyard. His goal is to fly but with a plane like this i wouldn't be surprised if he was actually joking i was calling myself an artist but now uh, it seems like uh, i'm an engineer because i create uh, something that amazing and something look like a real thing i fell in, in love with the police vehicles it attracts me meanwhile somewhere in cameroon The top blades function as a fan, so that passengers don't get hot. This is a leaked footage of Zimbabwe Air Force training. With this kind of chopper, I just hope that the pilot is okay. Even the seatbelts don't want to fly. Okay, suppose it takes off. What's his plan on landing? The actual flight part of this video is still classified. Top secret if I may. But I still want to smoke what he smoked before building this. Meanwhile, somewhere in Nigeria. <laughs> 